So I wanted to talk about glutathione. It's one of the most powerful antioxidants in your body. Your body makes it, and you can also get it from your diet. Um, because it's a sulfur compound, it's high in foods that are high in sulfur, like cabbage, broccoli, cauliflower, uh, radishes, all the cruciferous vegetables, okay? So glutathione helps prevent the damage to your cells. It has anti-aging properties. It helps detoxify xenobiotics or chemicals in the environment. I mean, every year we have like thousands of new chemicals in the food chain, in your environment, in your lawn. Let's say you're a golfer, you're gonna be exposed to you know, the chemicals on the grass. So it's, you're constantly being exposed living on planet Earth. So over time, glutathione gets depleted when you get older, when you get stressed out, when you get infections, when you consume junk food, when you eat sugar, when you're exposed to a lot of pollution, and if you had an infection, okay? So it, over time, it gets depleted. So when to take this, that's the question. Well, let's say you're, you're on medication right now, and uh, you know that's gonna create some cellular damage. I would highly recommend taking it if you're on a medication, like a lot of people are on a lot of medications, or you're in an environment there's a lot of pollution. Like last weekend I went to LA and I couldn't believe the air quality was so bad. I mean, I just, I could feel it in my breathing. So if you live in LA, I would definitely consume uh, more glutathione or start consuming the cruciferous vegetables, or if you wanna get a concentrated version, you could do it in a pill form as well. So you wanna start increasing this in your diet. So you'd also want to take it if you experience more stress in your life, if you have some disease, let's say you have Parkinson's or Alzheimer's or diabetes or any of those diseases or chronic inflammatory diseases or rheumatoid arthritis, this is going to really help you counter those effects. Or let's say radiation. Uh, radiation can uh, destroy your cells. Let's say you're a pilot or you fly a lot in high altitudes. You're going to get exposure to more radiation or you had a lot of x-rays. Uh, I was an x-ray tech uh, before I was a chiropractor. I used to go in nursing homes and take x-rays and I would never, and I know this is bad, I would never wear a shield. I would just take an x-ray like a, a foot away because at nursing homes you have people that couldn't hold the breath so I had to be really tricky to come in the room fast and catch in on exhalation to get the uh, chest x-ray or there'd be movement so I didn't have time to you know, prepare. I probably should have, but I didn't. But I was exposed to radiation. So uh, this is something that I consume on a regular basis that is actually, I know it's helped me. Or you're exposed to mold. So it's very important to take this to slow down the damage to your cells. All right? Thanks for watching. Hey, you probably already subscribed, but if you haven't, press this little button down below and I will keep you updated.